In today's tech video, I'm going to show you how you can easily mirror your iPhone using a Roku device to your Westinghouse TV. Some of the newer TVs that are coming out have a built-in way of mirror your iPhone to the screen, but not all TVs have this capability. So two ways and I'm going to show you how to mirror your iPhone will work on any model of TV and any year of TV. You just have to have an HDMI connection to plug into. Now this works with the Roku Ultra, Roku Stream Bar, Roku Smart Sound Bar, Roku Streaming Stick Plus, and the Roku Premiere. Here are the instructions on this. First thing that you're going to want to do is grab your remote control, hit the home button on it if you're not already there. This is the home screen. And you're going to want to make sure that your Roku is all the way up to date on its latest firmware. So you're going to want to go down to system, click over, and then go to system update and then click OK. And then to check now, it'll make sure that it's on its latest software update. Once you have that established, go ahead and click the home button again, take you to the home screen. And we're going to go back down to settings, click over. And then here you're going to click on Apple AirPlay and HomeKit. This is something new that Roku has implemented on all their devices. And what you're going to want to do is click on that. It'll take you to the AirPlay screen. Now it is available on all Roku devices except the very lowest Roku device. I'm not sure what that one's called, uh, um, but most of your devices will have this. If not, you might have to upgrade to the next one up. All right, once you're on this screen here, AirPlay settings, make sure that both your, your iPad and your Roku device are both on the same Wi-Fi in order for this to work. Make sure that AirPlay over here on the top right column is on. Right here on require code. I have mine set on first time only. If you click on that, you'll see that it's first time only every time or use password. So that's all based on preference. Since I'm the only one using this TV, first time only is plenty for me. Okay, once you're on there, okay, we're going to go over to our iPad here and on the top right corner you're going to swipe down and it brings up this menu icon here and you'll see where it says screen mirroring you'll tap on that and then right away um, i have two of them that show up but right there it says roku streaming stick roku streaming stick i'll tap on that it starts thinking okay and it's asking for the code that is on the tv there so mine's 3393 yours will be different 3393 and then i'll click ok it starts thinking there's a check mark now and as you can see it is mirroring exactly what's on my t or what's on my ipad is on my tv now and if you want to stop mirroring that's where you would select the stop mirroring button right there on your ipad but uh, now you'll be able to mirror everything that's on your ipad there if you want to watch youtube videos uh, here's the wonderful thing about it if you are watching a video most of the time you have to go in landscape mode like that to utilize uh, the video but you can still hold it just like this and it'll play in landscape mode on the tv so that's the beauty of apple airplay but yeah this is the easy peasy way of doing this no third party apps or anything no wires just wirelessly mirroring from here to your roku device well hopefully this video was helpful for you if it was go ahead and throw a thumbs up on it go ahead and subscribe to my channel i make tech videos all the time and i would love to have you back in the next one Take care.